Well, I think if I had to don any garb, it would be a Proteas jersey. We're about to talk cricket and, of course, the triangular series currently happening between South Africa's under-19, Sri Lanka, and, of course, Zimbabwe, and our SA team off to a flying start. And we're now joined by two up-and-coming stars, Vian Mulda and Wandile Makwetu. Gentlemen, congratulations on a stellar start to the series. Congratulations for the national call-up. I know this is something that means a huge amount to you. Um, uh, Vian, this must be the dream start, yes, but it comes with a lot of preparation where is the the headspace of the team at the moment how are you guys feeling after getting this kind of dream start yeah we're really happy as a team um, we couldn't have asked for anything more from any individual um, for the first two games we played really well um, the opening batsman Wandi and Matthew, Matthew yeah. gave us awesome starts um, so yeah it's been really good we, we're really happy and we excited for the Tri-Series to carry on. So much has been said about the balance in the team and, and we can't say enough about individuals putting their hand up and needing to supply those performances but you've got to have a balance. There's a lot of pressure on the older players um, to provide that leadership role even more so on your side and you've got to be uh, an all-rounder added to that as well. Yeah. What, what is working for the team at the moment? How have you been able to find that balance? Because you guys don't get a huge amount of time to play together as a team. You're kind of thrown into these situations. Well, they've played a lot of cricket. Um, there's been Coke Week, there's been Cubs Week, and they've come off some serious performances. Many, most of the guys who made the team here have taken fifers in the recent, recent on form, month. Yeah. Um, scored 100, scored a lot of 50s. So the guys are really on form, and um, I think that's why we're playing so well at the moment. They can't ask for any, anything more as a captain. Um, and I think the players are proud to, to don that badge as well. Yeah. How proud are you to get that national call-up, Wendy? And congratulations, Century, um, in the warm-up, Century in your opening game as well. Um, how are you feeling about being part of the national setup? Yeah, it's a really special feeling. And obviously, to have started so well, it, it just shows that the hard work pays off. Uh, so I'm enjoying the starts. Um, hopefully, I can carry on throughout the series. But I know every guy in the 15-man squad, it's a really special feeling for him pulling that jersey over his shoulders. And, and to go out there and do your country proud is something that we've dreamt about for a really long time. So it's just nice to have started the way we have. How does it feel making it that step up? Obviously, you've played some pretty high-stakes cricket. So anyone who's played even first-team cricket um, knows that the standard is incredibly high. And you've got to kind of um, already prove your chops back then. How, how much more difficult or how much more pressure, because you seem to respond to that, um, how much more is there to deal with on that international level? Now, obviously, every, every time you take a step up, there's a bit more pressure and, and the skill level from the opposition is a lot higher. So we've had to make that adjustment and, and our coaches really just allowed us to go out there and play with freedom. So for us, it's just about being going out there and having fun and, and playing and expressing ourselves. So we've done that really well so far. But, you know, we just have to adapt to the, the pressures that this level brings and, and hopefully we can keep doing that. How are the, the Saints boys reacting to your, your meteoric rise? Yeah. <laughs> a, a, lot of my friends, a lot of my friends will be sending me messages saying, well done. Uh, keep going uh, and they know how hard we've worked and how hard we have worked to be at this level so they're really supportive of us and, and they're really hoping they excited for us to come back to school and do the same sort of thing when you're back there. Oh, it's amazing to me that you're a schoolboy. It just actually blows my mind. And then um, just very quickly, lastly, a, a mountain to climb for the Lions going back into the domestic season. How, how are you feeling about getting back to your, your team in that side? Firstly, to get there, it's a lot of hard work <laughs> and it's a dream for anyone. Yeah. Um, I'm sure one day he wants to be there one day. Um, but yeah, we we it's really fishing, excited. Boys, it's fishing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's been good. It's been good. Um, I, I can't wait to get back. Um, obviously, it's an honour to represent your country. So yeah. I'll take it with both hands. But as soon as I get back, I'll be working hard and be ready to go back. Ah oh, man, you're setting an incredible example. Um, I love the fact that you and Matthew have got this great, incredible dynamic. So keep providing those tons, son. Um, but Vian Wandi, thank you so much for joining us, and all the best of luck with your next game on Thursday. Thank you. Yeah. Well, clearly cricket in very good hands. Make sure that you support our under-19 protests, of course, in that triangular series up against Sri Lanka and Zimbabwe.